I am I know I'm not gonna get Avian J, so I'm gonna do my typical thing where I, I do a different name and we'll just see if people can recognize who I am. Alright. This is about Australian fish. I was curious because I know nothing about Australian fish. So the Australians are probably gonna win this easy. Like what is that? I wouldn't even know what family to put this fish in. It kinda looks sunfishy, like Sencharkid. But the fuck the head shape is so weird. I just guessed yellow belly because it had a yellow belly. <laughs> That's it. Yeah, I know I know literally nothing about Australian fish. I have no idea what that is. Literal kindergarten question? Okay, well if you don't know Australian fish, sometimes you can get tricked. If you didn't know, there's a species of woodpecker called the red-bellied woodpecker, which doesn't have a red belly. And then there's a species of the woodpecker with called the red-headed woodpecker, which doesn't have a red head. They're swapped for some reason. Baramundi. Yeah, I kind of knew that was Baramundi just because I know the general shape. I have no idea what this is. I guess process of elimination, I could tell what this is. But by knowledge, I would have no idea. If it sounds okay with an Australian accent, it's probably the answer. Trout? Oh, it was a bass, really? I put snapper. I thought I, I guess it was some kind of sea bass that I don't know about. What is a river brown fish or a river black fish? What? I have no idea. It looks more blue than black or brown. I mean, it has some brown on it. Okay, I guess it's a river black fish. I, I, no comprende. I don't live in Australia. I don't know these fish. I'd be killing it if I did. What? There's multiple marlins. I didn't even know there were multiple marlins. And then there's a sailfish. Black marlin. How was I supposed to know it was a black marlin? I picked blue marlin because it looked kind of blue. What the fuck is that? What? No idea what this fish is. I'm going to assume flathead because it kind of looks like it has a flathead, but a flathead what? We have flathead catfish, but that was not a catfish. Like a giant sculpin or something. Um, good to know they have very similar trout and salmon to us at least. But then the other weird stuff is just, I have no idea. What? Why did I not realize that was a brown trout? I totally picked salmon. That's embarrassing. What is that? Okay, well only one of these sounds right. Only one of these sounds Australian. The rest of these don't sound Australian. Yeah, that was the only one that sounded Australian. I knew it wasn't a zebra fish. The rest of them sounded made up. Well, obviously catfish isn't made up, but they sounded made up. But Ludric. Ludric just seemed real. Name this fish species. What? I, I, I just have to make a guess at the Australian language. Well, it's obviously not Satoga. If it is Satoga. <laughs> Alright, I guess that there wouldn't be an H because Australians don't seem like the type of people to put H's in words that don't get pronounced. You know what I'm saying? Maybe that's a bad read. Okay, this one I know. This is the first one I've known. Jesus. Can't say this word on Twitch. Blur it out. <laughs> that's a big one, too. Still a lot of people picked it. Interesting. Is it just because I mention it? Like, if I mention one of the options, do you guys just pick it automatically? Wait, it's neither. It's none of these. None of these are correct. They spelt it wrong. Or maybe it's spelt different in Australian. But I'm pretty sure in English, isn't it Murray Cod? Isn't there an A after the a after the R? What the fuck? Oh, it was a trout cod. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. My bad. Oh my god, not another fucking... One of these guys. Fuck this Kahoot high key. Okay, but if you were Australian, you'd be nailing this, you know what I mean? Just lack of knowledge. I know so much more about Australian fish now. Let's go. At least pretty much everyone got that one. All right, last question. Name this fish species. What the fuck is... But it's still spelt wrong. Isn't it Murray? Am I crazy? Isn't it M-U-R-R-A-Y? I could have swore it was the Murray cod. Not the Murray cod. But whatever. Alright, third place. Boomoo. Second place. Prairie sea lion. First place. Goosh. That's right, bitches. I'm Goosh. That's me. Get shit on. I've never been to Australia in my life. Or fucking looked at a single Australian fish. Ever. Wah, wah. Stupid ass name. That was unnecessarily rude. Now we begin. This is, I believe, uh, South American fish breeds. 
Now, I don't really know much about aquarium fish. I don't really work with aquarium fish. Oh, I clicked the wrong one! Fuck! <laughs> I already fucked up. I already clicked the wrong one. Whoopsies. My bad, chat. Name this fish. This one I know. I know some of these because I worked at a pet store for a little bit. I know a lot of you guys like aquariums, but I don't know that much about aquariums. People ask me so many aquarium questions. Like, I know the basic needs of a fish, and I can tell when a fish is being abused or in, you know, a bad environment or something like that. But I don't, like, fucking know the pH parameters for your, your better or some shit, you know what I mean? Like, people constantly ask me, like, what do you think is the ideal pH range for a marmo mass moss ball in a South American like cichlid tank? And I'm like, what are you? Why? Stop. None of these words are relevant to me at all. I don't know these things. Oh, sweet booby. I love suckers, dude. Let's go. I love just any sort of sucker. They're just so cute. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Dude, Platy, Molly, and Swordtail? I don't really know the difference. I know Swordtails, I think the males have a sword tail. But Platy versus Molly? Dude, no clue. Oh! Oh, it's so beautiful! It's so beautiful! Imagine this in the wild. This tiny little Soprinid, it's just a tiny little baby carp. It's so beautiful. I love it so much. Dude, little Soprinids are so sick. Dude, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Molly Platy. Why were there so many questions about Mollies and Platties? I don't know the difference. I guess I gotta learn the difference between a Molly and a Platy. Oh, it was a Molly. Let's go. Alright, in third place. Fishy Fishy. In second place. Wishy Fishy. Sorry, Wish Fishy. And in first place. Beans and rice! Get fucked. I know you can't really see it. Oh, there it is. Get fucked. First again. Alright, one more. What the fuck? <laughs> What's going on? I'm concerned about this quiz. This is supposed to be a Minnesota fish identification quiz. What is going on? <laughs> Quick, everybody get in so we can get off this screen. This is supposed to be a Minnesota fish identification quiz. Alright, let's get going. I'm over this. Minnesota fish ID. Fish? What a crappy question. So true. This one too. This is a crappy question. That's gotta be the black crappy. You'd be right. It is the black crappy. What kind of trout am I? Oh no, I've chosen the wrong one. I chose the wrong one. Whoopsies. How do you win when you choose wrong ones? Oh, I'm not winning now. I'm in like 30th place. I've gotten like three wrong. What do you mean duck? What, you, really, you really couldn't think of a fourth fish? You just typed duck? I bet because it's small, a bunch of people are going to pick fathead minnow. Just because it's small. Yep. 51 people picked it. It's not even small, it's just the fucking image was really small, so you guys picked Minnow. You're so predictable. Ow, sweet booby. It's a carp, of course. Why did 13 of you pick smallmouth bass? I guess it did have a small-ish mouth, but come on. That's a carp. How have you watched me and you don't know carp? Who am I? Oh, you're a sweet booby is what you are. That's kind of a tough question. The ID keys between the two, the red and the yellow option, are pretty... Yeah, man. I don't know the difference between a walleye and a sauger. We don't have both in New Jersey. We only have a uh, walleye. But they look pretty similar. Oh, minnow question. What? What? What do you mean? None of these are real words. Or this... Uh, this isn't a real word. Shiner doesn't mean anything. There is no such thing as a shiner. There is no group of shiners. These are spot tails. These are either spot tail or swallow tail shiners. There's no clear image. I, my guess is spot tail shiners. But they're not actually shiners, because then there's like luxulous, there's common shiners, which are in a different genus. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. Angry. 
Oh, okay, now you give me the fucking... Now it's an adult fish in a large image, so it's easier to identify. But before, you give me this tiny image of a sauger, and you tell me to tell the difference between the sauger and the walleye. Fuck you. Yeah, bass... Well, no, bass does. Bass... There is such thing as the sea basses, which are the true basses. And then there's a bunch of other things that are called bass, but they're not. And there are true perches, and then there's a bunch of other things called perch, but they're not. But there's no such thing as true shiners. There's no true shiners that... And then everything else is wrong. That's why shiner's a dumb word. Anyways, third place. AVNJ. Not me. Second place, Zany Sphinx 90. And in first place... What? Who's what? It's actually not me this time. <laughs> Who was what? Is no one in chat gonna admit to being what? No one's gonna admit? Okay. Well, that makes sense, because... Get fucked. <laughs> the classic bait and switch. <laughs> he tried to bait us into lying. Yeah, I wanted someone to lie so that I could make fun of them. But you know what? You guys were honest. I will give you that. None of you lied about being that person for the glory, for the temporary glory. Oh.